And here it is, the last of the three. EVV. Personal favorite promo of the three. I just really love the artwork on this particular EV. It contrasts the Pikachu one very well. But by itself, it's also just a beautiful piece as well. So as always, we're going to get... Sorry, this is making so much noise. As always, we're getting the same exact spread of packs. Rebel Darkness Vivid Battles. Which is solid. I'll be honest, that's actually a really solid uh, spread. But what we gather them is what matters. So hopefully... We'll get something cool today, and if not, you can't win every single one of them, and I'm fine with that. But it's always fun to get a nice shiny card out of your booster packs. I really like the artwork on that Metapod. So let's get right into it. Starting off with, uh, oh, that's a really cool regular rare. But starting off with Rebel Clash, most commonly known by the Pokemon Funny Men as Rebel Trash because it has lower pull rates than normal. And going right into our second pack, which is Darkness Ablaze, we have paper packs again, it looks like, because it took almost nothing to open that. Let's see what we get. Hopefully something cool. I need something cool to go back there with Eevee. Oh, an Agron Hollow, okay. That's not the coolest, but it's pretty cool. It's cooler than nothing, which I'm happy for. I, I actually really appreciate hollow poles because they're just like... You're still getting a good pull. And I feel like a lot of Pokemon content creators are super, like, super ungrateful that they pull such insane things because... I don't think they realize that a lot of people that watch these videos can't afford cards the way you or I can, or can't even get cards the way you or I can, because of their area, and, uh, you know, just when they see a big guy complaining about something cool coming out of his pack, then they're just kind of like, huh, well, that takes the fun out of the hobby for you, at least it did for me. When I was still only watching videos before I started again. Let's see what we get in our last pack. And a Crobat Hollow. Very cool. Okay, so this time around, we really didn't get a ton. We only got the EVV and two Hollow Rares, which, while not incredible, are still fine. I'll take them. Because I'm happy enough that I got this Eevee out of the out of the tent itself. And honestly, for me, for 10 bucks, it's not a huge hit miss. Even if the pulls were not super, super great. Now, they do this deal every single year. It's one of my favorite deals. And I would have done more. Like, I remember, I think, last year before I quit YouTube... Which I'm never doing again, by the way. Like, subscribe, and comment if you haven't already. Um, I remember I loaded up on these. I think it was either last year or the year before. And I opened like 10 or 15 of them for videos. And most of it wound up just getting thrown in the trash. Because I think I quit in the middle of uploading everything. But never again. I'm sticking to it this time. And uh, I know what to do to grow the channel, hopefully. Hey, thanks for sticking around for the whole video. Catch you in the next one. Peace out.